Hello guys, here is a breakdown of this simple strategy I used to bag over 100 pips in minutes on this trade. Hello, I am Purity Godfrey, your Forex trading expert. In this video, I am going to give you a breakdown of how I got this trade set up and show you how you can use this same strategy to maximize profit. So, let's proceed. Right here on the chart, as a forex trader, once you come to the chart, the first thing to do is to identify the market sentiment, all right? So for me, once I come to the chart, I try to understand the market sentiments and then study the behavior of the market to enable me make my trading decisions, all right? So how do you understand this concept? First is to have a bigger picture of the market, all right? So before I got on this trade, I had to take a look at my higher time frame to establish my directional bias, all right? So first of all, let's just take a quick look at the daily time frame right here here on the daily chart guys as you can see we have a bearish trend right here switch to bullish trend in this form okay so first thing is to identify your structures and mark out your structures correctly so right here we can see that we have a bearish move right here okay we have a break of our previous low in this form all right and after that we have a pullback right here and then we have a break of our previous low right here okay afterwards price went back up took out inducement from here so there was no inducement take out on this one price took out inducement push lower and break our major structure right here and after breaking our major structure we have series of inducement formation pullbacks right in this form mass guys can you see so if you look at this there is no inducement take out here there is no inducement take out here there is no inducement take out here so this becomes a major change of character right here so at this point, as you can see here, okay, price took out inducements from here. And we we're expecting price to push lower to break our previous low. But instead, price pushed higher, giving us bullish internal structures, okay. And right here, we have a major structure high, which is our chalk right here, okay, if price goes above it. So after this break right here, okay, this signifies that there is a shift in market momentum from bearish right to bullish so having identified our change of character at this point right our bias is now bullish okay but that does not mean that we are going to fold our hands and ignore the sell setup there are strategies that i teach in my mentorship program which you can use to maximize profit trading the retracement okay with that being said guys how was i able to get on on this trade and maximize over 100 pips profit right so after a change of character first things first where is our inducement we have our inducement sitting right here okay if you have not watched my video on inducement and market structure you can find the link in the description box so that you can get a better understanding of this concept so after inducement was taken out where is our pure because after inducement price can move higher or lower price can choose to mitigate any pure all right so where are our pure right here we can see that we have a valid other flow sitting here okay and then if we also extend it to the left you can see that this is a valid demand zone right here okay and then we also have another high probability extreme puri right here we have a valid other block with clear imbalance right here so guys you can also watch my video on how to identify valid and invalid other blocks okay so having identified our POIs right here okay we now have a bigger picture of the market and understand the market sentiment okay so on that note we are going to scale down to the lower time frame to plan our trades and understand the market behavior to get in on this trade so right here on the four hour time frame let me delete this all right so here on the four hour time frame guys we can see that price has already mitigated our POI right here and we also have some market behavior that confirmed this poi high probability poi so remember once price taps on your poi right here okay and there is no confirmation to go long that means price wants to mitigate an extreme poi right here so always wait for confirmations as your poi and learn to study the market behavior okay so right here on the four hour time frame let me go ahead and take out this poi so that you can clearly see the charts right here okay let me zoom this a little bit so you can see clearly okay so right here on the four hour time frame you can clearly see that we have you know a lower low here we have a pullback okay and then price took out inducement from here all right which validated this our major structure high okay so if you have not watched my video on how to identify valid pullback you can check the video link in the description so at this point as you can see price broke our major structure right here okay and afterwards price pushed higher and swept this high all right and then we're expecting price to push lower right probably breaking this low 
but then price failed to do that okay we had a period of consolidation around this zone and so guys at this point you need to have in mind that price have tapped into a higher time frame poi okay and on the daily time frame price has been sitting on this zone all right for days okay which is why we scale down to a lower time frame to understand the behavior of the market so at this point guys we do not have much information right here because after we have a sweep of this zone right here okay we can see that this is a period of consolidation around here these are just inside bar candles all right all of these are inside bar so we have a period of consolidation so at this point we do not have so much information to get involved on this trade based on this time frame so at this point i had to scale down to my entry time frame which is my 15 minute time frame all right to further study the behavior of the market and know how to get involved on this trade if we were to short or if we were to go long okay because at this point the market was just consolidating right so to get a clearer picture i had to scale down to my entry time frame which is a 15 minute so on that note let's scale down to the 15 minute and have a better view of these analysis okay so as you saw the higher time frame, the market was in a period of consolidation, okay, trading between the high and low of the candle, right? So right here, we can clearly see we scale down to the lower time frame to get a better picture and finer details, all right, of the chart, okay? So right here, we can see the market is in a period of consolidation. So since we have a higher time frame information, which we have at hand, we are going to critically analyze these internal structures and see how we can get involved on this trade okay so like i have always said you can trade internal structures you can trade major structures you can trade pullbacks and you can trade in the direction of the trend all right you just get the right knowledge and acquire the right skills so right here as we can see this is a period of consolidation right here the market is trading internally but we need to study the behavior right now to get involved in this trade so first thing is to mark out our structures so internal structures right was bullish switched bearish and then switched back bullish so how was i able to identify this concept so as we can see clearly right here we can see that we have a break we have a pullback we have a break we have a pullback right price fit to make a new high right here okay and then what happened we have internal structure right switch bearish this way okay we have it like this like this and this now some traders will do the wrong thing to mark this as a pullback guys this is not a pullback why as you can see this is right they are all trading inside this can do okay so you can watch my video on pullback to be able to understand this concept so you need to open your eyes to see clearly on this market because it is full of traps guys it is full of traps so moving on we have our pullbacks this way okay so as you can see okay we have a valid pullback here which is our inducement okay so let me take this out so you can see clearly right we have our pullback right here okay and then afterward price took out inducement so after taking our inducement from here okay we have a break of our previous structure right here and after break of structure inducements have been taken out this validates here our major high okay which in turn is our chalk all right if price goes above it so what happens guys as you can see clearly in this period of consolidation price has switched bullish to bearish and now we are now in a bullish trend okay so having a proper understanding of market structure is very vital in your forex journey so after identifying a major change of character right here where is our inducement as usual we have our inducement sitting right here okay so after price take out inducement guys i knew it was time to pull the trigger okay but looking closely you can see that there's another thing that happened here right you can see that before this move right here there was a liquidity build up around here right inducing more traders to buy around this zone and guess what guys they were all stopped out around here all the stop losses were hit before the trade finally moved in this direction so sorry for my drawing guys all right so after this man was taken out guys that was the right time to hop in on this trade so let me also show you a quick one on how to use price action right to get in on this trade so at this point guys if you're a price action trader like myself you and i left behind okay let me quickly show you how you can use price action to also get involved in this trade okay so if you look closely here you can see that we are in an upward trend internally all right so as you can see internal structure is making higher highs higher lows higher highs higher lows all right and in that progression okay so having seen this guys what are we going to do we are going to draw our trend line to get a valid trend bounce and then ride the trend okay so right here how do you draw your trend guys okay so we are going to draw our trend like this okay 
So after this what next? Remember you need to have at least two or three confluences to validate your trade setup on the chart, okay? So as you can see, okay, we have a bounce here, we have a bounce here, we have a bounce here, and then we have another bounce here, okay? So if you do not know how to draw your trends correctly, guys, you can sign up for my mentorship program where I teach you the secret code to trade price action profitably. So like I said earlier, right, we need more than one confluence to validate our setup on the chart, right? So if we look closely here, okay, we can see that we have a supply and demand zone seated around here, right? So we can clearly see this is our supply and demand zone. So with this extra confluence, you can establish your trade decision at this point, okay? Although I teach several entry decisions and confluences in my mentorship program, all right? So right here, as you can see, okay, based on our price action strategy, right? We can see that price broke our previous high right here after tapping into our demand zone right here, okay? So just like the SMC concept, right? After market momentum shifts from bearish to bullish, right? We have a break, a momentum break, and then we have a pullback which bounced on our trend and then our demand zone, okay? Giving us an entry. So right here at this point, guys, we can also see some rejection candles at this zone. So at this point, guys, we can pull the trigger using the price action trading strategy. So guys, as you can see on the screen, this is the same trade setup that I took and I shared this signal earlier on with my community on Telegram, guys. If you are not in the Telegram community, click on the link in the description box below to gain access to winning signals and more educative content like this. So guys, this is the simple strategy, right, that I use to maximize 100 pips profit on this trade, all right? A minute, guys. So thank you for watching this video to this point. You inspire me to create more videos like this. And remember, all I do in this channel is connecting you to wealth, connecting traders to wealth. So if you have not subscribed to this channel, what are you waiting for? Go ahead, hit that subscribe button, turn on post notification, and don't forget to like, share, and drop your comments in the comment section as I will be there to read your comments and get more inspired. Thank you so much, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Remember, subscribe and stay connected to wealth.